My name is Colin Strong and I am head brewer at Salt Beer Factory. My brewery story began in the year 2000 in Liverpool. I was uh, in the midst of dropping out of university and working in a brew pub. I uh, didn't really know what I was going to do with myself. <laughs> I was a little bit lost, to be honest. Head brewer at the brew pub was the son of the manager of the pub, and he decided that they couldn't work in the same building anymore because they used to fight like cat and dog. His dad asked me to, whether I would get involved, not due to my vast love of beer or brewing or my knowledge, it was more just because I was the only person who had time on my hands and I think he could pay me minimum wage at the time. But uh, kind of unleashed uh, something I didn't really know was within me about sort of recipe creation and about sort of process running. Um, it was never something that I had in any way really engaged with before, but I actually started to find that I really enjoyed and that I could really work with. From speaking to uh, the, the team here, I sort of felt that we had sort of a, a kinship in what we really wanted to achieve through brewing, uh, that we wanted to make hop forward, inventive, uh, creative beers, but at the same time we, we wanted to make them accessible and, and make them available to the wider public and engage the wider public and, and give them a, hopefully a better knowledge of what goes on here. Probably the strangest thing we've ever brewed with uh, we made a beer, it was a collaboration with our friends Arizona Wilderness when I was uh, at a Buxton Brewery a few years ago and we made a bacon, maple syrup and chipotle porter. It, it, was, it was odd. So uh, we went to a local farm shop, got as much sort of bacon as we could from everyone. Everyone at the brewery got sent home with four kilos of bacon, I think it was, and had to cook it remove as much fat as possible and bring it back in on the Monday for dry baconing. Uh, that was good. So my favorite superhero is Batman. I'm Batman. Uh, because he doesn't rely on any special powers per se. He's trained and he's got himself to where he is. He uh, innovates and uses the sort of things around him to develop new ideas and develop ways of making things work for what he wants them to do. And I like to think that we do that with brewing as well. That's so cheesy, Jesus. It's true though. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite salt beer is probably the Citra Junior. It's a 4.3% uh, session IPA uh, made with all Citra hops. It was the first new recipe I did when I started salt. I mean, it was <laughs> the recipe was written as a bit of a cop out because I thought, right, it's my first one. Got to nail this, it's got to be really good. And I thought, what can I do that just absolutely will not go wrong no matter what I do to it? So it's a very simple malt grist of just pale ale malt and oats with um, citra for both late and dry hop uh, using London fog yeast. And it's really delicious. I've got a real soft spot for it.